Oh God, I'm so happy. What's up everybody? I'm at Happy Lamb Hot Pot here in Houston, Texas. Let's go inside and check out the hot pot. Let's go. This is the location on Westheimer Road. There are two in Houston as of 2023. I came on a Sunday night, so this is empty at the end of the night. I'm gonna sit way back there. This is my table, and I'm gonna take a seat and just show you. Hey, my name is Nick Gray. Uh, please give me a like if you like this video. Let's pick the broth. As soon as you sit down, you have to pick the broth. I will choose the original marrow broth. You can also have best of both worlds for one of each. The broth is fantastic. Among the best broths that I've had, the floaty things, the red ones right there, those are goji berries. There's also Chinese herbs and spices. The meat is all you can eat. There's two choices, regular, and then here's the premium version, $31 or $26. I will pick beef and lamb to start. Lamb is on the left, less fatty, beef is on the right. There are two multiple different types of lamb and beef that you can select. I just happen to pick these. If you want fish or other options, you'll go to the bar. Let me show you a tour of that now. Behind me is the bar, the options to get the meat here at Happy Lamb Hot Pot. Now there's fish and there's shrimp and there's lots of vegetables, which I like. And then back here behind me is all the dessert and the rice. Let's check it out seafood area they have fish they have baby clams baby octopus peeled shrimp they even have crabs I'm a little hesitant to do seafood but do the seafood it's delicious let's walk over here because there's many other options all of these still all you can eat by the way Ooh, these are some additional options I'm looking there's pork dumplings dry egg noodles King oyster mushrooms, I really like those. Lamb tripe, lobster balls, so many. Take a look. These are just another example of how Happy Lamb does a very good job of including many different ingredients. Tempura, beef tripe, fish balls, mini pork sausages. You can pick anything from over there, but then I really like to come to the mushrooms. One suggestion is I wish they did have more mushrooms. These are other vegetables. These need to sit and marinate and soak in your broth a little longer. There's some tofu, as you can see, broccoli, which is fantastic. Let's check the other end. As we go over, I showed you the seafood already, but see all those greens over there? This is among my favorite things to add. I like to add the bok choy, the cabbage, and the spinach to mix up with my meats. I don't like that one right there, watercress, but the spinach on the left, I really do like that one. As we come over to this other area, again, this was the end of the night Saturday, so they've removed, no, sorry, Sunday. They've removed some things, but I asked them for rice and they were happy to bring it to me, no charge. This is very important. This is the sauce bar. The sauce bar is how you will mix your dipping sauces to dip your meat. There's also some oranges. When do people use oranges? Let me know there in the comments. By the way, if you like this video, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Here's some fried chicken, some egg rolls, spring rolls, more options all around. All you can eat. What a great deal. I will show you what I have built now. Hey, that's me again. Thank you for watching. I love, ugh, I love hot pot. It's like my favorite thing in the world. So here's the vegetables. I'm adding all of this into the broth and I let the vegetables and things stew and marinate for a while, but I will watch carefully the meat. And that is really what I'm only letting into the hot pot for 20, 30 seconds. You need to make sure that your water is boiling, but I don't like it to overboil. I've done hot pot a lot, so I'm pretty savvy with knowing when my meat is ready. By the way, if you want a drink, here's the drink station. There's also ice cream that you can get for dessert at the end of the night. They have other dessert options. These were some cakes right here that were available. Some dessert cakes. Again, it's end of the night, so there's limited selection. Well, it was awesome hot pot, and I loved it. I would definitely come back to Happy Lamb Hot Pot here in Houston, Texas. Check it out. Hey, if you like this video, will you give me a like? It really helps me out. Leave a comment and say, hey, where you're coming from. Thanks for watching. Bye.